it's time for a DigiKey unboxing. Let's take a look at the ADAC 4380-4 Evaluation Board from Analog Devices. The Quad 16-bit 4 mega sample per second ADAC 4380-4 Micro Module Solution integrates signal processing and conditioning blocks to simplify precision measurement systems and instrumentation, motor control, sonar, and many other DAC applications. So, let's get started. Inside the box, you'll find the evaluation board with SMB connectors and test point hooks for all four differential input pairs. On the back is a 160-pin FMC connector that plugs into an SDPH1 controller board, which we'll use in the demo. In this demo, we're going to use the ADAC 4380-4 evaluation board to capture and analyze a 10 kHz sine wave. Plug the ADAC 4380-4 evaluation board into the SDPH1 controller board. Plug in the power and USB for the controller board. Then connect your signal source. Ours is set to a 10 kHz 10 volt peak sine wave. Notice the four blocks of jumpers. By default, these set a gain of 0.3 and an input range of plus or minus 11 volts, but they can be changed to set different gains using the precision-matched integrated thin film resistors based on ADI's iPassives technology. Open the ACE software. Double-click on the ADAC 4380-4 eval board block to view a block diagram of the board. Then, double-click on the ADAC 4380-4 block in the center to see the internal block diagram of the IC. Click on Proceed to Analysis. In the Capture section, change SDO mode to 4-wire and note the sampling frequency changes from 2000 to 4000 KSPS, giving us the maximum sampling rate of the device. Click Run Continuously to capture data for a few seconds. Then click Stop Capture. Then we can click Zoom and change it to X Direction, then zoom in to see our sine wave. You can also unclick the other channels if you're not using them. Next, we can look at the FFT of our signal. Turn off the other channels and zoom in the X direction so we can better see our fundamental and up to the fifth harmonic. In the results, you can see the exact frequency and power for the fundamental and each harmonic as well as the THD, SNR, and other values. There are also options for histogram, DNL, and INL analysis, and you can export your data for further analysis later. Thanks for watching.